My name is Ashton Bray. I graduated in 2013 and I am at the University of Oklahoma. I am studying accounting and finance. Hi, my name is Lainey Humphreys. I am attending Oklahoma State University in Stillwater and I'm majoring in nutrition. Um, my name is Abby Black and I go to the University of Oklahoma. I am studying elementary education slash pre-law. I'm going to be a doctor attorney. And my name is Anthony Raybert and I'm a freshman at the University of Oklahoma. Uh, currently, I am Business Undecided, leaning towards accounting with a minor in Spanish. My name is Nicholas Newton, and I'm attending the University of Oklahoma. I'm studying Marketing and Finance. My name is Lauren Morf. I am graduated in 2015, and I go to the University of Oklahoma. I am studying Pre-Dentistry. Will Hickman, and I go to the University of Oklahoma. My name is Sina Farazoli, and I go to the University of Oklahoma. Uh, I'm studying pre-medicine. I'm studying international studies with a minor in economics. Hi, my name is Alicia Nasher, and I am a senior at the University of Oklahoma. I am studying health and exercise science pre-medicine. My name is Sam Delili, and I go to the University of Oklahoma. I study civil engineering with pre-dental. My name is Kirsten Crook, and I am a student at OU. My name is Asher Nice and I am at the University of Oklahoma. I am undeclared in my major. Um, I've considered a number of things and I'm just pretty unsure right now. My name is Meredith McGuire and I'm a senior at OU. My major is biology pre-med. My name is Justin Wu. I'm at Harvard University in Boston and I'm looking to concentrate in applied math. My name is uh, Ty Neubauer. I'm from Norman and I currently go to the University of Oklahoma. I'm uh, currently studying finance. Hi, my name is Kelsey Couch and I am currently a freshman at the University of Oklahoma and I am studying accounting. What I miss most about Norman North is playing soccer and being able to interact with the people I grew up with every day. I miss Spud Week the most, honestly. Spud Week was a lot of fun um, and it was great to help out families in need. Um, is how easy the community came. Um, it was right there, placed in your school. Um, you develop friends, gr friend groups, kind of about th in the classes that you had together um, and the activities you did. And the biggest adjustment academically um, is probably and how to manage time. Probably the fact that there's thousands of kids at OU that I don't know. So meeting as many of them as possible. Um, just like having to make new friends, um, I haven't had to do that in a really long time just because we go to school with one another that we've like grown up with every single day. Another academic adjustment is responsibility. You have to be a, a lot more responsible because you don't have parents there uh, making you go to class. The biggest adjustment was um, having to make my own review sheets for the tests rather than in high school get it. Um, review sheets. So if I had high school to live over again, I'd make sure that I was involved in soccer. Um, not necessarily just soccer, but a sport, because it really gets you within a good group of people. If I had to do high school over again, I probably would have taken um, harder classes and tried a little harder in school. Some of the things I would do differently would be not taking a zero hour senior year. If I had to do high school over again, I would definitely take challenge, more challenging classes. I would definitely go to every semi-formal without a date because going with your girlfriends is definitely more fun and you make way more memories that way. If I could change one thing about high school, I would probably go to more sporting events like, you know, track and swimming. One word that could describe my life since Norman North is challenging. Just refreshing. Probably busy. Hard. Opportunities. Key. Different. Awesome. Better. Real. It'd be a surprise. Adventurous. Experience. Um, I can't think of a word good enough, so I'll just make up my own. Scrumtralescent.